Hey guys, it's Rob, and welcome to Legend of Lagaya. Now this is a game from my childhood, and I'm gonna be doing like a preview of it. I'm not gonna be doing a full playthrough yet. I might in the future, but I just want to show off some of the game. Like a very small part of it right now. I don't know if I'm gonna commit myself to, uh... Like a 40 hour game right now, but I just wanted to show off some of my one of my favorite games God created the heavens the earth and the seas after creating all things in the universe God created humans to rule over this world yet while possessing the wisdom of God humans were physically weaker than the wild beasts and impulsive in spirit many times did the humans come at close to dying out forever Concerned about the humans' future, God gave them a mighty force with which to aid them. <clears throat> it was the Siru. Since the dawn of human memory, known as history, humans lived together with creatures known as Siru. The Siru lived together with humans, always obeying them and making the humans many times stronger than before. When not worn by a human, a Siru looks much like a stone figure. However, Upon touching a human, a Siru changes form and gives that human secret abilities. With the Siru, a human can lift objects heavier than itself and even fly in the air at will. However, that era came to an end. Appearing from out of nowhere, the mist covered the land, bringing an end to, bringing to an end prosperous symbiosis between the humans and Siru. After the thick mist came, the Siru, who once obeyed humans, rebelled against them. The Siru began attacking humans at will. Siru that attached themselves to humans controlled their minds and turned them into evil beasts. As if forsaken by God, human civilization collapsed. It was the twilight of humanity. Those who escaped the mist inhabited the desolate areas and protected each other. Now their faint hope is their only source of inspiration. Now this is a PlayStation 1 game. So, the frame rates are not great in this game. Uh, during battles and other times and the graphics are kind of primitive but for their time they were really good like really good I don't have any kind of filters on so the graphics are going to be nice and crispy it's fun yeah, that name's fine. Now this game is kind of hard. Like, if you don't know what you're doing, and if you don't grind in certain spots, you're gonna get your ass kicked, and you're gonna have a bad time. Which is another reason I'm not sure if I'm gonna do a full playthrough. I've never actually beaten this game, but I always loved it as a kid. And it's actually the game that made me want to get a PlayStation 1. But, uh, <clears throat> we'll, we'll see what happens. Ah, Vaughn, I knew you would be here. The mysterious Genesis tree. This is a soothing place. You always like this tree. Tomorrow you will become a hunter. Uh, you will become a hunter, an adult. Are you praying for a successful hunt? Uh, not really. Uh, sure. 
That is good. Then I, too, will pray for your success. Vaughn, I thought I would come here to cheer you up. But I guess that wasn't necessary. You will be a fine hunter. I'm counting on you from the bottom of my heart. Ha ha ha. Options, field move, run, uh, vibration off. Wow, if you put it on mono, it actually gets louder. Weird. So you know what the. Let's go back to... Yeah, Alright. Just leave it on the wall. Bon, when you go hunting outside the wall tomorrow, bring me back a souvenir. No. Bon, I love the Genesis tree too. That's nice. Vaughn, I was looking for you, so you were praying at the Genesis tree. It's about the hunting clothes for you to wear tomorrow. Is something wrong? I'm almost finished, but I have to check some of the measurements. So can I measure you one more time? Sure. Thanks, Vaughn. You're so kind. I'll be at your house waiting for you, so don't be too late. I'm gonna go in your house and never mind. Oh, it's you, Vaughn. The hunters should be returning shortly, so I'll be waiting here. I'm gonna go into all these houses and steal their shit. Never mind, you don't have any shit. And I don't care about talking to you right now. Let's go to my house. It's getting late! What could he be doing? I'm sorry, May. That Vaughn, I wonder where he's wandering around. It's alright. My father hasn't come back from hunting today yet anyway. I should be the one making hunting clothes for my brother. Don't worry about it, Neen. I just wanted to help celebrate this special day for Vaughn. Um, May, can I ask you something? What is it? May, are you in love with my brother? She got so embarrassed. Aha! I knew it! What took you so long? May has been waiting for you this whole time. You're always wandering around with your head in the clouds. Let's hurry up and take those measurements. Vaughn, hold still. It'll only take a minute. I knew it! You've gotten bigger since the last time I measured you. I can make a dick joke, but I won't. You're almost as big as my father! Maybe big- Not gonna make the joke. It's amazing how quickly boys grow- Alright, I'm done. Thank you, Vaughn. Mr. Val, little Neen, if you excuse me, I'll be on my way. Thank you, May. Give my regards to Juno when he returns from the hunt. I will. Alright, let's go into the cabinet. Healing leaf. Hell yeah. Yo, sis, what up? Did you thank May properly? Uh, no. Ooh, you are so hopeless. You're going hunting tomorrow, and that means you're gonna be an adult, right? Well, if you're an adult now, you should mind your manners. Oh, fuck you. I I'm sorry, Vaughn, but my hands are full. I'll listen to what you have to say later. Well, what the fuck are you doing? Alright, I'm gonna show you guys something cool. But first, I'm gonna save the game. Where the fuck is the save point? I don't remember. Hello? Sobbing. Silence. Oh, little Vaughn, you saw me crying. How embarrassing. Long ago, I had a shop here. I sold many different weapons. When I was cleaning, I began to remember those days and suddenly started to cry. Someday, if the mist clears and all the people come back, I'll be able to open my shop again. 
Bonnie, you must promise to shop up my store, alright? Well, you could open the store now and I can buy shit with my $500. What's up here? Do you have shit for me? Is that it? Can I open this? The drawer won't open. It's locked. Fuck you. Yeah, I want to hit a save point. So, yeah. Save point, please. Before I show you guys something neat. Uh, where is the save point? I think it's in here. It is not in here. Save point. Save point. Save point. Fuck. Alright, I don't know where the save point is right now, so I'm not gonna do it. But I will do it shortly. You were a child when the mist appeared, Vaughn, but now you're ready for the hunt. Time goes by so quickly. I have taught you the teachings of Byron all your life. Do not forget them when hunting outside the village. Now then, Vaughn, do you want something today? Uh, let's, let's, let's fight. I see, before we practice, take this. Now you are ready, come at me. Alright, so, one of the coolest things about this game is combat. I will show you how to fight when engaging in an actual battle. So basically, the way this game works is you it's like a fighting game kind of you input your commands and it's cool That sound was significantly louder than the other sounds. Ow. Your de defense increases when you do spirit and your action gauge gets better. So I'll be looking up a, uh, a move list. Because otherwise they're really hard to figure out. So I'm just going to... Uh, look at a move list like I do every time I play this game or the sequel the sequels not super good good that is enough practice for today did I win you did well that is enough for today well what else do you want I want nothing what I would like is a save point. They're back! The hunters have returned. Oh, there's the save point. By golly, they were gone a long time. Well, I hope I don't die. Father! My father is back! Welcome back, Father. Did you catch anything? <gasps> it's a guy on a stretcher. What happened? Is that... Is that... It is! It's Juno! It's May's father. Father? Father? So sorry, May. It happened so quickly. Before we knew it, the mist came earlier than usual. Juno was attacked by the Cereo monsters. There wasn't anything we could do. Father! Father, wake up! Please, open your eyes! Father! No, don't leave me all alone, father. Please don't. Bon is all like, I'm sorry. 
Oh, please. So I believe Vaughn is a silent protagonist. I'm like 99% sure. I don't think he ever says anything. Which some people would say is lazy character design. And some other people would say that it's a... Uh, it's good for storytelling. The mist always takes away people we love. I hate the mist. Tell me, Father, will we always have to live in fear of the mist? When will we be able to go outside the village safely? Nina. Father. Vaughn. Don't worry about May. She's calmed down considerably. It will be dark soon. We'll stay here with May, so go home and don't worry about her. All right. Good, then be careful on your way home. All right, I'm gonna... Before before I do that, I'm gonna... Y yoink your... Shit, never mind. It's empty. Bye, May. Rest in, rest in penis, your dad. All right, now can I save? Okay, here's a save point. Good. So one neat thing about the save screen is every single save slot is of a different character, which is really cool. So the first one is Vaughn, then then uh, your second party member, then your third, then it's Tetsu, Mei, Nin, don't remember, not sure, uh, somebody I'm not going to talk about right now, not sure. Some old man, not sure, not sure, uh, actually I think I know who those three are, uh, I don't remember who that is, but yeah, every, every safe slot is a different icon, and that's neat. Okay, so, now can I go show you guys the cool thing? Now is probably not the time to go show you the cool thing. But let's do it anyway. Never mind, now is not the time to do the cool thing. Unless I did it wrong. Hang on. Nope, now is not the time to do the cool thing. It doesn't work. Hang on, we'll do the cool thing in a bit. Hi, Dad. Vaughn, you look sad. I understand. Juno was a kind man. Soon the mist will come. You must be tired. Do you want to rest? Not yet. I see. After all that's happened, it's no wonder you can't sleep. Oh, you're back. Juno was such a gentle person. May is all by herself now. She must be lonely, so be nice to her. Okay. Vaughn, you look sad. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, let me rest. Good. Rest well, then. What is that sound? Vaughn! Wake up! Can't you hear that sound? Vaughn, wake up! Are you awake now? Vaughn, listen carefully to that sound. I think it's coming from beyond the wall. Vaughn, would you go take a look for me? Sure. That's a good son, but hurry back at the first sign of danger. Yeah, that sounds pretty bad, just saying. I'm scared! Vaughn, be very, very careful. Just saying, that sounds like really bad. Oh jeez, it gets even louder, I forgot about that. I sense it. I sense the presence of evil outside the wall. The precious wall that has protected Rim Elm, it could never collapse. If the wall breaks, the mist will enter the village and the horrible Siru will come in. Yo, old man. Oh, Vaughn, so you came to check on the wall, did you? This wall has protected Rim Elm from the mist for over ten years. Hopefully it will stay standing forever. Ah, quite impressive. Look how many puny humans survive. What? 
What? What on earth is that? Pitiful creatures, you humans. Living in fear of the mist, you scream at the sight of a Seru's shadow. Pathetic humans. In this desolate place, you thought this flimsy wall would protect you from the mist? Humans, you are but insects. The time has come to abandon your foolish resistance. I am Zito. I have come to bring the salvation of the mist to you miserable creatures. Tetsu's like, Hiya! And then he's like, yeah, fuck you. Humans, now is the time. Accept the mist! And now we get this cool 1998 cutscene. Which actually looks pretty good for 98. Yeah, that wall is dead, just saying. And now the mist is in. The, the mist! Oh no, the accursed mist has entered Rim Elm. It is time. Siru, followers of the mist, it is time for you to attack. Siru, destroy that old eyesore of a tree. So now there's Siru in the village. Ah! And now she's receiving anal penetration. Save yourselves by accepting the serenity of the mist without resistance. It's still gonna kill me. All right, uh, I, I should have looked up a move list ahead of time. Uh, hang on. Hang on. Uh, hang on. La 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 la. Uh. Okay. Ready? Wait. Tetsu. Oh, Tetsu did teach me somersault. Okay. Uh. Hiya! Ow! All right, I'm actually pretty low on health. I would like for you to die. Please don't. Okay, I was gonna say, please don't tail fire again. Yeah, yeah, it's cheating looking up the moves, but it's actually, like I said, pretty hard to figure it out otherwise. Also, Slash Kick, you literally just flew up in the air and did, like, a... That, that wasn't, a, like, a... Ow. Should I heal? Alright, the Tail Fire does, like... Uh, how much damage did it do? Tailfire does about 50, so I should probably heal if this doesn't kill it. Alright, yeah, I should heal. Now, I'm not very good at this game. So, yeah. You suck! You mean you suck. Gotcha.
Tetsu, do you need help? Yuck, yuck. Vaughn, the Zero in the mist are after the Genesis tree. I'll hold the Zero here. The rest of you go somewhere safe. Alright, I'm gonna save the game, because that's safe. Now, you can go around and, like, try to save the villagers or something. Oh, right, there's random encounters here, too. Vaughn! I'm so glad to see you. I was all alone. I came here to get away from the serial monsters. Hey, have you noticed the mist doesn't come in here? The Genesis tree is glowing. It's radiating some kind of amazing power. The Genesis tree is very warm. Vaughn, go ahead and touch it. Okay. I'm sure nothing bad will happen. Vaughn gently touches the trunk of the Genesis tree. Something is speaking softly to Vaughn's mind. Vaughn. Vaughn, you are Vaughn, are you not? I have read your thoughts. I am speaking to your mind. I am Meta, a Rosaro. We have, I have been waiting inside this Genesis tree for someone like you, Meta. I ask you, Vaughn, do you wish to save your people from the mist? No, I want them all to die. Yes. Good. By combining our powers, we will rid the whole world of the mist. Let us pursue the same destiny as human and Rosaru working together. Alright. Vaughn, open your mind. Feel my presence. Well, if I don't, the whole village is fucked, so... The approaching mist is killing the Genesis tree. I am too weak. I need the life force of the Genesis tree to be strong. To revive the Genesis tree, we need the power to change destiny. The power of the human spirit. Vaughn, hurry. Hurry and assemble everyone here. Okay. How do I assemble everyone here? Now let's save again. It's a gobu gobu. effects in this game. Ow! Like, yeah, that hurt. No, don't steal. I only have limited healing leaves. Don't steal them. The money grinding is shit in this game.
Yeah, give me back my healing leaf. Cha cha cha. What? That is not what you said, but okay. All right. So see how the enemy icon has a little fire icon? If it has an elemental icon like that, then that means you can get that uh, as like a summon. That's how you get magic in this game. You kill these guys, and if you get lucky, you'll absorb them. If you're not lucky, you'll kill them and then have to grind so you get them. Which is loads of fun. Like I said, this game has a lot of grinding. And I need to heal Vaughn. He better not tail fire, because if he does, I'm dead. Just- Oof! 1 HP! Fuck! I should have died there. Absolutely should have died there. Alright, so these are like all the moves that I can learn right now. Hey, I got it first try. Nice. Okay, well, let's go save. Since I got it first try. Oh, you're back. Uh, how do I assemble everybody? I don't remember. Do I go to my house? Yo, dad. So the wall is destroyed and the mist is coming. Mist itself is not harmful. You can even breathe in it. It's a cereal you must fear. Come morning, the wind from the sea will blow the mist away and we'll be safe. But the question is whether or not this door will hold until morning. Vaughn, what is that? Th that's a Siru! Now I understand, although this is all so confusing. The situation is desperate. Our only hope now is your Cyril in the Genesis tree. Alright, tell everyone to gather at the tree. How did everybody get here? Safely. Vaughn, Rim Elm is engulfed in the mist. You and the Rosaru are our last hope. We entrust you with our lives. Everyone, we must pray together. Power of prayers is strong. Now's the time, Vaughn. Go to the Genesis tree. Awaken, Genesis tree. Remember the instant the heavens and the earth were born. Vaughn, you too must pray. Good. Harder. Pray harder. To push away the mist. To revive the Genesis tree. Open your mind. Pray hard.
game's music. Now there's no more mist in this area. Thank you. Thanks to Vaughn and the people of Rim Elm, the Genesis Tree has been revived. The Genesis Tree has the power to drive away the mist and to make a Ross Saru like me stronger. The mist has left Rim Elm, but it still covers the rest of the earth. Many Genesis Trees wait to be revived. Vaughn, let us leave Rim Elm together to look for those Genesis Trees. And now Vaughn is dead. Game over. Brother! Don't worry, he's just in a deep sleep. How peaceful he looks. He must be dreaming about something nice. No, I'm actually dead. Vaughn. I mean, I'm literally dead. And our friend Juno. The hateful fangs of the Siru took their lives from them. To Ferdy, god of the sea, we entrust their bodies. But Rem, our leader, our great leader, on your sacred wings, take the noble souls of our friends to the Valley of Nuaru. May their souls find peace and eternal happiness in the distant Valley of Nuaru. Mommy, where are Juno and the others going? To hell! To the Valley of Nuaro, dear. Far, far away beyond the sea. Is Juno going to come back? Will he bring us good things to eat again? No. The Valley of Nuaro is very, very far away, dear. I don't think he will come back. Genesis tree in Arasaru. We had some pretty important things here in Rimelm. Vaughn, Rimelm was saved thanks to you. You were truly courageous and I thank you again. However, it's about our precious May. Her mother may still be alive inside the mist. If you have pity on May, then rescue her mother. If you say yes, I'll tell you the rest of the story. Will you do it? No. Oh, thank you. Now, May doesn't even know this, but... May's mother, Maya, used to work at Byron Monastery. Ten years ago, the mist came, and naturally, we lost all contact with her. As for whether Byron Monastery still survives in the mist, unfortunately, no one knows, but Maya is May's only surviving blood relative. Vaughn, with the Rasaru, I'm sure you can make it to Byron Monastery. Vaughn, I'm counting on you. Okay. One more thing, Vaughn. Keep this a secret from May. She will only be heartbroken if... Iron Monastery has indeed been lost in the mist. Alright, let's go 
save. Alright, I think I can show you guys the cool thing now. And hey, the shop is open. Alright, here's the cool thing. Look! In that tree! Bees! What? Oh god! Oh god, what have I done? Bees! Rest in penis, Vaughn. Are you all right? Yeah, why are you hiding a boss in the fucking town? That's bad. Can I go do it again? Yes, I can. All right. All right, bees, round two. Never mind, I forgot you're auto ambushed. actually impossible to beat them right now if you're so tough how could you let those bees beat you again well you see they ambush me and do more damage than I have health that is how I let the bees beat me welcome what would you like all right what do you got you got a kniff Yeah, I, uh, don't have a lot of money. Uh, the boots are good. I kind of need healing items. Uh, do I get the boots? I'll get the boots and a healing item. Why does your shit gotta be so expensive? Like, literally. Vaughn, the mist may have left the village, but Beast and Sir lurk beyond the wall. You'll need weapons and an armor. No, you don't gotta teach me about it. I've played an RPG. Oh, Vaughn, I'm glad to see you. Now the miss is gone. Yeah, your son is helping me. Alright, so there's an item called the point card, and I don't remember how to get it. Is it in... Can I open the drawer now? No. I don't remember how to get the point card. But the point card, basically, when you spend money, you get points on it, and you can use it on any enemy. You do a shit ton of damage. I don't remember how to get that. Vaughn, you don't know anything. Yeah, yeah, fuck you. I don't remember. Do I have to go back to May's house? Vaughn! Wait, Vaughn! Phew! Oh, I'm glad I made it! Here, I brought you the hunting clothes I promised you. Vaughn now has hunter clothes. Hey, Vaughn, what's the matter? Are you alright now? Yes, I had a good cry. 
and making your hunting clothes took my mind off everything. Vaughn, I heard from the village elder you're going on a long trip. Well, take care, and don't forget to wear the hunting outfit I made you. Be sure to come back when you finish whatever it is you have to do. I mean it, you better come back. I've never been good at saying goodbyes. So, I have to go home now. I'm sorry. I'll be waiting for you to come back, Vaughn. Alright, let's save. But first, let's put on those clothes. So another cool thing about this game is when you equip items and stuff, like uh, armor and other shit, you actually see your character wearing that armor, which is neat, and not a lot of games back then did this. And most of the armor looks cool. Some of it looks really dumb. But most of it looks cool. Alright. Let's go fight the bees again. No, I'm kidding. And I love this song, too. How do I access the map? Can I access the map? Yes. Okay, so the hunting spring is right over there. We're going to head to the castle. Now you actually walk faster going diagonal, I think. I think. At least it looks like you do. I, I don't know. Nine gold. And a healing item costs one hundred. That's not good. Oh, Vaughn, I'm glad you came. I'm impressed you made it here by yourself. Yeah. Ah, you're so confident. You're a lot hardier than us hunters. I'm a child. I'm a literal child, and that guy has an axe. I don't have a weapon, and I'm a child. I'm like 15 or something. By the way, Vaughn, see that guy over there? Yeah, he has a unique sprite. Don't know him? Well, we come here often, but this is the first time we've met someone else here. He says his name is Lesum. And he's telling us the most amazing story. That's quite an amazing story! Come on, you should talk to Lesum too. Before I do that, I want to heal. Clean waterfalls from the stream. You want to drink it? Yep. What delicious, refreshing water. HP and MP are restored. I forgot what these statues do. Oh, they're tutorial. I don't care. I am called Lazome. I serve King Drake, ruler of Drake Kingdom. So you're Vaughn. The hunters have told me of you. You have done great deeds. You have my gratitude. Tell me why you're grateful. Yes, this is about something that happened before the mist reached here. I was heading to Rim Elm under King Drake's orders to warn them of the mist. The mist caught up with me, and I became a Siru monster. What I hear was your deeds that enabled me to become human again. That is why I am grateful. Thank you so much. Drake is around. Okay, let me stop you right there. You became a Siru monster. Okay. When I did the Genesis tree before, all the Siru monsters that were in the town fucking exploded into polygons. Why did you not explode into polygons? 
Drake is surrounded by the mist, and King Drake is surely awaiting you. Your powers. With your powers, our castle could be saved. Will you help us? Alright. Oh, thank you. Please do whatever you can to save Drake Castle. Before I departed, the king had made a frightening decision. I hope he is safe. Okay, bye. I think you can save on the map. Yeah. Two Gobu Gobus. No, don't steal. I need those, like, really bad, dude. better not be able to run away with my item. Twenty-five gold. Yahoo! That's four battles for one healing item. Door of Light in the treasure chest. So Door of Light lets you escape dungeons. Alright, so this is a dungeon. And... Do I want to do a dungeon? Because like I said, this is an intro episode. Uh... We're not gonna do a dungeon. Not right now. I might pick this up. I just, like I said, there's gonna be a lot of grinding involved, and that is not something I'm looking forward to. And the game gets really hard at some spots. But I'm having a good time so far. It's a childhood game. So, that's basically. Uh, Legend of Gaia, just like a, a quick intro of the game. And we'll see what happens. Maybe I'll pick it up. Maybe I won't. Maybe I'll do it in the future. But I want to thank you guys for watching. And until next time, Rob out.